Welcome back to part 7 of my Emir Sodan game. In the previous part we were able to expand a little bit northward, got Lanciano, and then we also won a war uh, and got the Duke of Sicily under us now. Um, probably going to look to expand up the boot a little bit. We are actually kind of under the effect of a rather minor disease right now. I don't think it's going to affect us. We did We did actually seclude just to make sure hopefully that nothing happens. Our character is, well, not in poor health, because we have Rat Hunting Cat now, <laughs> but uh, he's not doing too well overall. So we should be becoming our heir soon, who we're hoping is going to have a kid with his wife. Um, she doesn't seem to like me very much. Let's keep converting these, I guess. We don't really need claims. Uh, I could start increasing the development here. Uh, this one has a university. It needs 30 to build, though. It's not fantastic. If we can get up to Siena, there's a university that you can build that only requires gold and not a particular level. Uh, this guy might end up being a decent marshal for us. I think I'll just leave it on gathering the gold for now. So we are like bordering the Pope, this fat Pope, fat drunk Pope. Uh, and I would love to do this, but I just don't see it being possible. He has, like, I mean, we have a lot of gold right now too, but the thing is his income is so high, 26. He usually just hires so many mercenaries. Plus, I don't know, is there a way that I can just check their holy orders, actually? Holy sites? Nah, I don't think you can actually check. Although, they're usually the first to get a holy order. We don't have any, so if he called a holy order, we'd almost certainly just lose the war if we tried. I'm tempted to maybe try this. Now let's just wait, probably. Sardinia is actually a very real possibility here. What's going on here? How on earth have you gotten this title if you're a eunuch? Um, okay, so we inherited it and then became a eunuch, I guess. His sister... That's her son. Okay, so that guy's going to inherit it eventually, so nothing really is going to happen here. Uh, this is actually really tempting. It's great land. It, it actually wouldn't be a terrible spot for us to use as our uh, capital either. I, I feel like having it over here just because I am uh, playing Kingdom of Sicily, but Sardinia is certainly very tempting. I think I might attack him though. He's weak, he doesn't have anything. I, I guess I can't Holy War him? No, I can just conquer him. I'm not sure why I can't Holy War him. I'd rather do that to make sure that I get all the land. Uh, let's get our daughter married, though. To someone. So who are you? Shabanid. What is going on here? You're in a war anyways. Uh, Andalus, also in a war. Al Sark, you're not in a war. He's 38. It's not too old. He's right on the water there, so he'll come. You can have my hunchbacked daughter. Uh, just for someone to help us a little bit here. So he's still going to have that piece of land here. So I'm assuming that I'm going to get this stuff personally. Maybe his vassals will become my vassals. But if he still has this piece of land, then he, there's no way he can still hold anything in here. So I'm pretty sure I'll at least get three. I believe. I'm not super familiar with the Conqueror case of spelly. Uh, but yeah, let's just go for it. So we call you in here. And let's just go have a look where his army is before we land. Uh, if I can just go for his capital, I will. 
these two are his vassals for whatever reason. Prolific get 200 gold, or we get inopetic. Or we just keep the stress. Yeah, that's fine. Um, don't mind the stress at all. Restraint, I guess, we take, yeah. Embrace celibacy. Uh, we probably actually will be able to get the warning before we die. I didn't think we were going to be able to get there in time. Elusive Shadow. Okay, he got a pretty good education. He has 15. So we can use him here if we want. Uh, hopefully he's got a good relationship with his brother so we can use him as a spy master once he gets some land. I just remembered that I haven't came out of seclusion yet. I was still hiding away. Oh! He had a albino son who died, unfortunately. Nothing we can do there. Oh, he got frozen grief too, dude. I don't think I'm gonna be playing any of my characters for too long this game. I seem to just be jumping from one to the next. Uh, where did he go? What's this? What is that? My vassal's vassal is involved in some war, getting his land sieged. How are we doing here now? Okay, well, at least we're above where we're expected to be at. Dopey cat. Okay, we might just win here. 77%. Let's keep going. We did get something, though. That's exciting. Excellent tapestry. Got some minor benefits at least. New mosques established. Additional taxes. You love to see it. Uh, I guess we could upgrade a little bit here. I'm never aware if there's actually a penalty to having over the limit here. It doesn't seem to indicate that there is. Like there's no negative red whatever <laughs> thing warning me. Uh-oh. Orbitello. Holy war for the Duchy of Capua. Who are you to be declaring war on me? So he's obviously got allies. He is allied to Pisa, who generally don't have that big of an army. 686. He is allied to the Duke of Genoa and the Count of Ajaccio. I didn't know Genoa is pretty big. Okay. Don't usually see that. It's kind of interesting. So that could be a problem. I am going to increase these uh, so we have more fighting power. We're going to have to raise them up. Is there anything we're missing here? I guess we're maxed out already. I don't plan on keeping these long term, uh, but for now they're fine, I think. So is this guy winning this without me? Please don't make this take longer than it has to. Oh. God, that's really even. No, he lost it. That's annoying. It's going to take some more war score, but I don't think it's going to really matter too much. Yeah, I'm not going to pay for that. We're done having kids with her. That should be it, I think. There we go. Okay, so exactly what we thought was going to happen happened. We got those three counties, and he's still independent, just over here. Uh, and then these two guys became our vassals. He's my prisoner. We could convert him. Um, we can revoke as well. Yeah, I think we do that. We want this one for sure. Maybe I will just move my capital out there. Uh, get executed, you heathen. And we're, we're going to revoke from this guy as well, but just not yet. I'm going to disband this, I think. Three months. They might siege something. It's fine. We will get our ally back into this war. Craven. No. 
How do you only have three prowess? God. Okay. How are we doing here? These things, we'll just let them heal up. Uh, we can usurp that. I, I'm assuming something's going to look different here. Yeah, he's going to get two, he's going to get one, whatever. We can figure it out. Our character is still feeling fine, so we shouldn't just die randomly before we get know thyself, hopefully. Uh, we do need to do something with all of these counties, though. Okay, are you still going to get this? Yeah, we can give that to you. Uh, I kind of want to... Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Okay, let's just figure it out after the war. We're three over the limit. Hopefully they don't hate us too much for it. No, that's too much. Okay, let's... This son here... Let's get him married. Uh, since they don't tend to do that themselves very easily. No alliance. Not low porn. Any adults? No. Within five years. No. Within five years. Okay, so it's like her. She looks fine. Let's just do that. Um, and then... can make that kingdom now. Duchy of Capua. And then we'll give that to him. I can't give the... Okay, whatever. I can just hold it for now. Uh, make sure to put his capital on the one that's not getting siege right now. Uh, so, okay, so 7 out of 6, that's fine. We can give him the duchy title after. He's going to get it naturally, and then this kid's just going to get two random counties. That's okay. How's the military doing? Still healing up a little bit. He's going to finish sieging Napoli, but it's not a big deal. How's this looking here? He's got 3,900. It's not nothing. Is uh, Al Sark actually coming? No. They are busy. They are busy, busy. Um, the, the nice thing about this war is that he's Orbitello. He's just one county count. So even though he's got a bunch of allies, if I siege his capital, I have him fully occupied. So regardless of the war score, I will get 100% war score if I siege him down. So I think I'm just going to swim up there and do that. Oh, she's my rival. We can just, we can just do this. <laughs> how, how mean do we want to be? You know what? Come here. Execute? No, it's not, not going to send the execute. Uh, she doesn't give us any benefit, though, when she's here. <laughs> I guess we can import a, a point of vizier. Um, no, let's just free her. I'm not particularly worried. If she's pissed off at us, then uh, all she'll do is try to murder us anyways. Oh, you're a decent knight. Let's get him, actually. Okay, so hopefully he just continues to siege that. Even though it's the war target, uh, we'll have this guy fully occupied whenever we finish this up. So as long as his army doesn't come up here, we should be fine. Oh, there, he's actually come to join us. I guess he likes us more than the other one. It's not his own war for sure, though, right? Yeah, no, he's just he's just participating in it. It's this guy's war. So apparently he likes us more than that other guy if he's over here. Uh, hopefully they don't kill my son in the siege. That would be kind of annoying. Okay, good. He's still around. Uh, so this is going to go from minus 39 and ticking in their favor to it should just be totally done. Uh, let's just get this done real quick. It pays 145 gold to me. It's not bad. Take their swords. Uh, we can finally put these guys down. I guess we'll do it over here. I'm tempted to just move my stuff over here, honestly. Let's do it. Everything getting moved over here. I think I'm going to move my capital there. We can make the... Yeah, usurp that. Give me that. You can have this. 
Uh, what are we giving you? Capua. There you go. So you enjoy that. Uh, have we moved our realm capital? No. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's start raising the control here. Uh, it's Sardinian here, which, like, I don't like. I'm not usually trying to promote culture too much. But Sardinian is kind of annoying. Especially if it's where I'm going to have my home. Yeah, let's switch it. Let's switch it. Uh, and then we'll have a look here. So this duchy title is getting left behind, but we have another son for that. So everything is kind of all good here again. Uh, we can just give him the duchy title in advance and one of the counties. And then I believe that last county should stay as ours after we do that. So we'll just get him betrothed to someone. And then you are the one we are going to leave in charge here. Uh, so what are we looking at? Yeah, perfect. That looks all good. Uh, so they did have that one kid, but nothing since. 28 and 27, not too old, despite him looking like an ancient old man. Uh, we got random land in random places, but it's, it's all good because it's all passing to us. Uh, I think I do like the idea of having Sardinia more eventually. Actually, maybe not eventually, maybe just right now. I'm just going to take that from him. Uh, and then we can build the mine here. 431 gold. It's not too expensive. Uh, so we either just hold one too many, or we give one of these away. I think we can just hold one over the limit for now. It's fine. Do we still get everything? Boom. Perfect. Apparently our heir is not super popular, only the zealots like him. The rest of them would prefer someone else, I guess. I don't know, we'll see. Uh, I could revoke from this guy since he's a hostile faith. He's going to revolt, but we'll easily end it. But the thing is, I, I can't do anything with it right now. I kind of want to keep this land to give to my brother once I become my heir, to make him like me as his brother a little bit more, as opposed to just giving it to him now when he already likes me quite a bit. And then this one I could just give away, but I think being one over the limit is fine. We'll give it away once we become him. So rat hunting cat. Medium boost. Oh, this is just permanent. This is until the cat dies. Temperate flagellant. Yeah, we just need to get our stress up a little bit more here, I think. Uh, so how can we do that? Nothing from hooks. Uh, giving away land when we're not over the limit. I guess what we could do is give land to our son and heir since he's going to inherit it anyway, and he can hold extra. So we do like this. And then we do like this. And then this stresses us out because we're ambitious. It doesn't give you stress if you're over the limit, but if you're not over the limit, stress. Okay, there we go. Looks kind of weird, but it works. Okay, so now with stress level 2... Oh, what just happened? Calabria? You idiot. What? He had four sons and they all died from measles? Bro. Bro. How does that happen? Wow. So she is a landed female character in Islam. Can I give her lands? That's really cool. I mean, let's just do that, I guess. So what's going on here? You. How about that? No, you gotta find someone to marry. Okay, maybe she'll do it, and if not, then we'll just get the land back from her anyways if she if she screws up and doesn't get married or something like that. So let's just give her the land. Uh, that's really cool. She sucks, though. She really sucks. She's kind of evil. Um, <laughs> Club-footed. <laughs> just horrible stats, horrible traits. Um, 
But you know, hey, good for her. Amira Sakura of Calabria. Maybe she can recover. The family got decimated. Smallpox. I think most of these are measles. Yeah, they all died from measles. Dad died from stress. <laughs> I can't blame him. I <laughs> just watched four of his sons die. Oh, wow. That's brutal. They were all hunched back, too. Well, some of them were. Anyways, good luck to her. Hope she manages to get married. Oh, I shouldn't be doing that. I don't want to drop stress right now. Do you need a chancellor after that? Okay. We could make him marshal. Uh, this guy, yeah, let's, sure, let's get the, my sons in here. None of you are having kids. It's annoying. Except for this poor bastard. Do we just put him in here too? I mean, this guy, what is he doing? Yeah, he's about to die anyway. Get out of here. Okay, so we got our sons, and then this random dude here. Oh, oh no, that's on her land. Uh-oh. Oh no. Okay, let's flagellate. It drops stress, but it also wounds us, so I don't know. This guy doesn't miss. He's too good. Absolutely goaded performance by this uh, court physician of mine. It's kind of annoying, though, because I, I do actually want to injure my character. I don't want to fire him, though. This thing's actually really good. It can give you up to three stewardship. I'm not sure what they need to have to be good at this. Um, oh. Probably we just take the stress here. I don't really feel like continuing to give this guy land just to stress myself out. You have to do something with your wife. Oh god, here we go. Oh, God. See, this is what happens when you don't do the thing with your wife. Frozen grief and typhus. Man, this guy looks deader than dead. Like, that looks really bad. He's looking unhealthy. So if that happens, then we have to play this idiot with Paranoid, which I gave him, so I can't even blame anyone <laughs> but myself. Um... Also albino. Uh, and then if something happens to him, then we're playing this guy. 58% we get wounded. Let's go. Lost the trait wounded. This guy is untouchable. Oh, no, man. So this guy inherits everything. He's holding too much, so now he gives something away to some random dude. This is not what we were looking for. Maybe I should just force him to get married. To a whole bunch of different people. You need to have a kid, my guy. Like, what's with these guys? Okay, so my daughter goes to marry that guy. He's been helping me out, though, so whatever. <laughs> do I buy this guy a book? Let's do this. He gets even better. There we go. Okay, and we lost our other steward as well. Uh, my daughter's back. Okay, she already got herself betrothed, I guess. I'll trust your judgment. Egyptian? Sephardic? <laughs> sure. Let's continue on. Converting? No, converting ours. Give me that. My son could have used that. That's what could have happened. So this is the one. Spotted fever. This is what took our son and heir out. Unfortunate. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna like try to force him to marry a bunch more wives, at least a couple more.
Lunatic. Okay. It's at least a, a health penalty. Okay, anyways, back to what I was doing. Um, so probably not Lowborn if we can help it. You're of age. Okay, we'll pick you. If you have a trait and you're not Lowborn, it's pretty much a go. Do I need anything else here? Scientific, I guess, just while we're uh, still playing this character. Finish that off. Let's just finish off Mots. Uh, you got two wives. Do we go three wives? Do we dare? Are any of you close 12? 11. You know what? Get over here. There we go. That we should be able to say goodbye to this character, hopefully. Uh, I don't ever really take this option. I just... The level of splendor is something that takes so long to level up. I'd rather not do it. Flagellant Lunatic, yeah. Uh, maybe we can just save up enough to build this, though. What do we need? 431. Try to keep an eye on it. Our income's actually not super high. You guys, come on. Oh, here we go, here we go. This either gives 6 learning or 6 learning and a severe penalty to health. And we got the good one. Okay, I'm... I'm this is just not, not going my way here. Bro, at least he got athletic. It's going to help us. Uh, <laughs> diligent and paranoid together is going to be extremely punishing. I I don't know if I can uh, play this character for too long. Double the stress gain and half the stress loss is going to be a challenge. Uh, usually I would do this for the unlock, but I'm just going <laughs> to take the stress, I think. It's kind of silly. The sucky thing, other than I was planning on playing the other guy too is that um now i don't have like brothers to give the land to i can just give it to random people but i do like to try to give it to family whenever possible they'll create their own branch they'll grow the house grow the dynasty uh, i will give it to random people though if i absolutely have to what are you doing holy war of the duchy of spoleto okay my son's doing that he's actually winning it too so he's just gonna get that land and then give it all to randoms i think it's, uh, yeah, it's not too bad. The Holy the holy Father is just uh, standing by watching this holy war take place on his uh, doorstep and doing nothing. There he goes, yeah. He served the Duchy of Spoleto. Boom. So that might have messed something up here. Yes, it did. Is it the worst thing if he gets it? We can always just destroy it. Yeah, let's destroy it. I don't want it, but I don't want you to have it either. I could raise that. You're not injured, are you? Okay, <laughs> he got scarred. I'm hoping that we can say goodbye to this character kind of soon. I was only half trying to kill him, but now I'm really trying to kill him. 305 stress. Severe penalty to health. I'll just keep converting. We got stuff that we can do. Keep raising the control. Flagellate. No! <laughs> One time, that's gotta fail. Is it still a severe penalty to health? Yeah, it is. Okay. I could hold court. 
there is sometimes some events here that will give you stress. Uh, Sicilian and Greek, do we care? Not really. We have 62%. I shall raise the boy myself. No. Reclusive, does that do anything for us? No. Burn him. I guess I still haven't gone to mech on any character yet. Uh, I just feel like it's a bit of an undertaking. Oh! Oh, he finally did the thing! One of his wives is pregnant. I don't want to jinx it. Um... <laughs> yeah, like, I don't want to do any of those. Uh, Zealot Vassal Opinion? Or we just come down here? Yeah, I mean, Scholarly Circles is nice, so... Kingdom of Sardinia. Yeah, see, I don't want to do this, either. Because then we're going to have two kingdom titles for our two sons. I think we just want to leave things the way that they are. I am assuming that a bunch of vassals have these. Yeah, Sicilian, Ashari. They just gave them the randoms. That's totally fine. We weren't going to be able to keep everything in the family forever. I guess I can finally take this guy's land away. Of course. Oh, my core physician finally died. I don't think I'll get another one <laughs> until uh, my next character. He was amazing. He was good. He was too good, actually. Kind of annoying at some points. I probably should have just fired him if I wanted to kill my character. Uh, how long until we can flagellate again? Ah! 929. March. Okay, it's like a year and a half. So we revoke, and we execute. No, I don't want to drop stress, are you kidding me? I can't, I can't torture them. Oh, this is what I can do. I can just release them. It causes stress when I don't do anything. If I ask them for something, though, it doesn't cause the stress. I kind of want to get rid of his claims, but he's probably not going to threaten me either way. Now let's just stress ourselves a lot like that. I'm not familiar enough with playing a... Uh, sadistic character to like remember everything that causes stress but yeah we just do this faction created against me why do you hate me so much there we go we will be dead within a year now we can execute the rest of you back to back to doing the fun stuff pay the ransom for my grandson why on earth would the pope have you what are you doing I didn't see that one coming. He's going for the Pope. Okay. I'm not sure that was the play. And you got your only... Ah, no, the Hunchback. No, where did that even come from? Literally just randomly got the Hunchback back? And his name's Sodan! What is this? How did that happen? A recessive trait? It got passed on? <laughs> how did that how did that happen? Is that just random or can it actually just like appear back in the bloodline again? Oh jeez, what a nightmare. Uh and now he's attacking his brother. You know what? Oh no, what's he doing? Oh his brother's attacking him. Okay, well. Whatever. We're just gonna let this character perish, and then we'll figure it out on the next character. It, it's, it's been weird. It's been a weird game. I feel like <laughs> I can't believe he tried to holy war the Pope. Like, let let Dad take care of that. Okay, we're not doing that yet. Uh, keep converting. I should keep an eye on this though. I don't think anything changed. Yeah, we're still good here.
promote culture. Do I keep doing it? Yeah, let's let's at least convert our home duchy here. I think I'm gonna keep my capital on Sardinia. Okay, there it is. Flagellated himself to death. It certainly took some time. Uh, <laughs> 10 years, 26 years, 26 years. It's the cursed number, I guess. Uh, so we're gonna continue on as Sultan Sadan III in the next part. Thank you for watching this. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe and leave me a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next one.